Okay, so just finished setting up this uh, little device. It's an NMEA to Wi-Fi bridge adapter by Yakbits. Um, it enables you to connect uh, your VHF with AIS or your chart plotter or whatever have device you have for receiving AIS targets um, to Wi-Fi so you can uh, uh, connect to it with your iPad and then subsequently use it on um, on your on your Navionics or whatever other um, navigational apps you might have uh, on there so oh, I'm just gonna have to come out of that but there you can see you can see the AAS targets there um, and you can pull up the information on them um, their heading the call sign speed all that good stuff um, you can also set up just go map options here in Navionics into AAS settings and you can set up collision and sound alarms or what I've done is I've had to turn that off because it was absolutely driving me mad here in the river because there were so many coming up and down so uh, I've turned that off and uh, but you can set you can set, set up your safe range time to intersect all that good stuff it's about 45 quid that little unit from the any chandlers so um, which I think is, is pretty worth it to be honest um, and uh, and not too difficult as mentioned to set up uh, it comes with a like set of a uh, quick set of instructions there um, just on setting up board speeds and um, you know you can connect to it using the URL and just connect up uh, make sure the uh, signal speed is is set up properly I've had to um, it, it's all, it should be set at 38 400 um, but the default is um, 4800 so uh and you'll need to set up whatever device you've got uh connected to it uh you'd, you'll need to set that up as well for the for the correct speed um otherwise uh, you won't get anything so yeah uh, thanks for watching it's reasonably brief this one but not too much to talk about any questions just uh, leave them in the comments below thanks for watching